Hi viewers, it's me here again, Ruby's Life in Oregon. So tonight, my husband will cook a chicken chow mein, Ken's version. So in here, he already cut uh, the vegetable. There's onion, bell pepper, water chestnut, bamboo shoot, pea pad, cabbage, carrots, mushroom, and garlic, ginger, and then so he will going to add cashew or almonds. And it's gonna be cashew. Cashew. And here yes. I am chopping up my garlic for it. Trying to not cut my fingers. And then I'm making it with fried tofu and some chicken. So I'm going to fry up tofu and chicken. And that's going to be the protein mix. And here's my chopped up garlic going at the top. It's, I'm just going to mix it in. I'm not going to stir fry it before. But the recipe called for stir frying it before. But I'm just too lazy. I'm going to just mix it in and it'll taste just fine. Okay, so this will um, gonna be taste good when it's done. That's a tofu. Here's the tofu. He's using a extra firm tofu from Canada. Made in Canada. And here's the cashew. But being an American, and added some ginger. Go. Okay, in here is the oil, so we just need to warm up the oil. Then my husband will going to stir up the vegetables, so they're gonna be mixed all the way. It's not cooked yet, but it smells and looks good. And then now add the almonds. Mix it again. Did I do that? I'm gonna check and see if it's hot enough. Ah! <laughs> Ouch! <laughs> okay. Not quite hot. No, it needs to be a little bit hotter. Alright. And these yeah, are actually, all the seasoning. We have oyster sauce here, black pepper, chicken broth, cornstarch, soy sauce, and then goes the tofu. So you just wait until it turns brown. Mm -hmm. Wait until it browns up. Okay. okay, so it's already golden brown. It's time to take out the tofu from the pan. In the vegetables. Whee! It's a little bit noisy in here because the pan is on. There. That helps. Then you just stir it. Let's try it up to six. You need to have a blast. Hmm? Blast of the fire. <laughs> Your fire needs to be high, so it's gonna be hot. The secret is you don't overcook the vegetable, right? Yeah, now it's starting to brighten. See the greens are starting to brighten. Now I add a little oyster sauce. Just eye eyeball it, eyeball. We don't measure because we know what we're doing. 
A little Just chicken kidding. broth, but not much. Okay. Wow, that is little. Black pepper powder. Now in goes the tofu. But not much. Corn starch. Sprinkling. So this is a pure vegetable, no meat added chow mein. Very hippie-ish. Okay, and it's almost done. Now transfer it to the dish. So the other half will gonna be cooked. And this is the other half of vegetable because our pan is not big enough so we just make it half and half it looks good it is good okay so now mm. added the now it's added the, sure puffle, the other half it's it's brightened a little bit for the carrots the and the same. celery. See, all the colors got more green. That means you need to start mixing and add. The same process as the first one. A little more chicken broth. Just because I still like it. Oyster. Soy sauce. Pepper. Pepper. Go fast. Then we mix it. Everything else is in there. It's like all the last one, corn starch. And the second batch is done. It smells good in here. Feel it? It's smelling good in the neighborhood. <laughs> and here's the finished product. Cooking with Ken in the kitchen tonight. Now I'm gonna try some. Let's see. Let's uh... The taste test. Let me see what it tastes like. Ah! Ugh! 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 No, not bad. Mm. <laughs> yummy. Is it good? Mm hmm. Very of yummy. Course. <laughs> All right, that's it for tonight. Cooking with Ken. Thanks for dropping <laughs> by. Have a nice day, everybody.